it's Michelle and I'm this is the narcissist series as you could see on the thumbnail <laughs> most people don't read so I'm just saying it anyway guys um let's jump straight into today's um red flag we're gonna not do tips we're gonna do red flags for this series so another red flag that you can look out for is when your partner is extremely extremely almost to the point of obsessed about the way that they look and the way that you look okay narcissists generally are obviously very self-absorbed they are so in love with themselves that they really can't love another human being okay but in that is an obsession with their exterior the way that they look so they will and again please don't take me the wrong way here i'm not saying people who take care of themselves or who do look good or who gym all the time or who eat well are all narcissists but this is one of the typical traits that you will find in a full-blown narcissist okay they are very self-absorbed very conscious about the way they look they always have to look good they have to wear like brand name clothing and accessories what have you drive a nice car live in a nice house it's very much about this picture that they are portraying to the world and also you have to look good okay their partner by their side has to match them okay because they're not gonna want to be seen with someone that is below them okay so if you are finding that um your partner or friend or whatever might be more concerned about how they look and how they dress and so on than the well-being of mankind in general then you need to also jot that down as a red flag and if you find that they are suggesting again guys the key word here is subtle okay narcissists are very subtle okay very subtle you have no idea what's going on until afterwards <laughs> usually okay well that was the case with me anyway so if you find that they'll be like no um that that dress is, looks very nice on you or that kind of dress would look very nice on you and it's a dress that you probably would never in your life go to, into the shop and buy or if you like having now this is really just an example you like having um, a French manicure on your nails. And this person is like, you know, you'd look really nice with um, black nail polish, for example. So they, they will throw suggestive comments at you. And at the end of the day, you this was my case anyway, you do things to please your partner because you want them. You want to look good so that they like you. So you want to look the best you can for them. And women do this and it's right and it's normal. I believe that's healthy. You do what's going to please your man. You know, you want to be pleasing to him. But the thing is, they, they do it in a way that you actually start believing that it was your idea to begin with. You never, they never put it in such a way that makes you feel like they're telling you what to do. They never say, do you know what? I really wish you would just paint your nails red. Okay, <laughs> they don't do it in that way. They don't say, you know, I really wish that you would just grow your hair and look like a lady. I had very, very short hair most of my life. So I heard that from my dad <laughs> many times. When are you going to grow your hair so you can look like a woman? Okay, so um, narcissists will very subtly try and turn you into the image that they want you to be. Okay, so be careful of that as well. Cool, guys. Have a nice evening.